Dr. Gatenio, having just finished the 140 lessons of English the Silent Way, I would like to turn to the concerns of uh, those people who will be using it, program directors and teachers. And I think that uh, one of the questions uh, that many people will have will be exactly why, why is there no teacher? Why are there only students teaching other students? Well, this is a very simple question indeed. <coughs> Since uh, we are teaching through television and not in the classroom, the medium has to be the teacher. And if I understand what television does on me, which is to affect me by its content, not by the directors. Uh, I don't see any of the producers, any of the people who are involved. I see the story. I see the people, the actors, and they seem to be in life. So what I want to put is a show which is uh, indicating to the people who want to get into the, the English language, in this case, uh, the people who are getting into it. And therefore, all they were going to experience is what the students experience. Yes, but the, normally when we're watching a television show, uh, we don't think of it in terms of uh, correctness or rightness, uh, the rightness of an answer. Uh, and these are, these are people who, who don't speak English. Uh, they're learning the language. How are they supposed to indicate to the students uh, at home whether the answer is right or wrong, or whether they have the criteria for, for judging whether it's right or wrong at home? Well, uh, go going to back to, to you as a baby, when you produced the sound, whichever sound you produced, your mother was so happy. Everybody was so pleased with what you did. They didn't say, because he's learning English, he should produce uh, the sound at once in perfection. And we are concerned with learning. We can accept. We can accept that some of the things that are being done require that uh, someone says it differently. But saying it differently goes to the ear. And the sounds are produced from inside, from within, through the throat, through a voluntary system. So if those students produce whatever they produce, you can say that's their production, not what they heard. And until you transfer from what you say to what you hear, you don't have criteria here. The criteria uh, don't come from the package of energy that the voice puts onto the eardrum. It comes from the analysis that this doesn't matter, this doesn't matter, this, doesn't, this matters, that particular thing. And then this sort of discrimination that all of us as babies do, I want the students to do again. And I want to do it fast. And mistakes are part of learning. I cannot eliminate mistake and say I'm presenting learning. 